What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Blind Visually in Hero Mode. Yay, this guy's been shooting at me. Screw him. He's an asshole. I will kill him. Oh, these guys don't have the best aim. They kind of spin around. They have, to, they have to do like some kind of weird cranking motion. Oh, that was weird. Yay, Ruby! <laughs> the last episode, we actually learned in order to get to one of these temples that are on our map here, a Gale Island and what's this one? Headstone Island. We need to come to both uh, this square here, Fire Mountain, and also this Ice Ring Island, I think it was called, but we haven't got that on our map yet. And the thing with Fire Mountain, anyway, is we don't have the ability to get in there. So, what, we, what I was told by the fish is to go one square north and one, two, three, four squares west to Mother and Child Island. Now, interestingly enough, we were there by accident once before. So let's teleport there now and see what happens. We we're told that we have yet we don't have time to, we don't have time to go there yet. But we shouldn't go there yet until we need to or something. It was not our time essentially, so let's go there now and see if it's our time yet. Is it our time yet? Mommy? Hello? Oh boy, here we go. Here we go! Ooh, sparklies! Okay there. Okay then is what I actually meant to say. So many sparkles! Oh my god! Whoa! She's hot! Oh my god, she's a child! <laughs> Alright, um... Tee hee! Greetings, child! Tee hee! It seems the door to the fate has already been swung open, has it not? I am the queen of the fairy world. What is the matter? Does this surprise you, child? I like you. And so I shall give you the new power to the bow that you wield. Oh, she uses them like a puppet. It's like a it's like a Ouija board. I mean, <laughs> oh, I, I was going to say Ouija doll at first. And then board came out. But I actually meant to say voodoo doll. Ooh, a red and blue fairy. Are you going to heal me? Ow! Oh. Link doesn't look like he feels too good. You powers of fire and ice have been added to your arrows. When you take out your bow, you ZR to charge your arrowheads and fire away, or change arrowheads. That's just, oh, look at that. that, looks so cool. I mean, the fire arrows make sense. I don't understand the ice arrows at all. She's dancing to her own theme song. Ice arrows can freeze the hottest flames and fire arrows can melt the coldest ice. Phrase in this fountain will ease your weariness. Use them if, as you need to. Child, I must tell you, you're just my type. <laughs> <laughs> the king of lions <laughs> just looks back at me. That's great. No, you're gonna date my daughter, Princess Zelda. Except that I doubt, I highly doubt Tetra is his daughter. I, I'm actually pretty convinced. And I haven't looked up any theories or anything. But I'm actually pretty convinced the King of Hyrule that we met a little while ago is actually, like, not Tetra's father. But I'm pretty convinced he was the king when um, Hyrule fell. And, like, he actually died. And this is just his spirit. Like, you know, we have unfinished business. So my spirit will stay in this world. I'm, like, fairly convinced of that. So, you know, he teleports. He doesn't have any, like... I mean, he, he takes possession of a boat. How is that possible? Unless he was just a spirit. Yeah, I grabbed that fairy because that'll be much more useful to us than... Um... Than a red potion. But okay. So, oh yeah. No, you know what? I did say I was going to explore this place, place when I came back here. Let's do that. I mean, there's not much to really see. I mean, it's really, really pretty looking. There's like a cloud over there. Purple clouds. I'll go for a second. Fortress or something. There's like a strange miasma covering it. This is a very squared off platform, but okay. Um, not very much going on here, to be fair. Ooh, cool. What's that? Oh, this is a piece of grass. Ooh, piece of grass. So we got a yellow rupee or something in there. There'd be. It's a lot of work for a single piece of grass. Bombs! <laughs> Mushrooms going on the trees and all that. Mushrooms. 
See, my question is, what happened to this tree? It looks blatantly like someone cut it down. First off, why? Second off, who the heck could have gotten in here with the proper utensils to cut a tree? And why? <laughs> what is the point? There's nothing in here. Maybe this part of the island needs to be, like, raised up or something. Or, like, fell in somehow. Or, like, sunk in, you know. Alright. So now we have the ability to use fire and ice. Now, we, while we could go to Fire Mountain and freeze the fire, we're actually going to go to... This is an ice ring aisle here, is it? Did I just count wrong? Or this is teleporting me to? I don't freaking know. We're going to go to ice ring aisle first. Why? Because everyone seems to like to do the, uh, I guess, the uh, the wind temp. Wait, is that right? Which one do I want to go, go to first? Did I not get the... Oh, yeah, I never did get the map fish from here, did I? Oddly enough, I don't understand why I didn't. You over there? Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is! Up top! Alright. Eh. Oh, by the way, the mini game we did in the last episode. Water self. <laughs> wow, great. Thank you, Sandy from Outside Island. That is wonderful. Um, what was I gonna say? Crap, I forget. Oh, yeah, the way to activate that uh, fishman, manfish mini game thing. The mountain fish is by feeding him bait after he's, he's shown you the square already. Let's open our sea chart. It's weird that uh, the Deku tree over here, what's this place called again? The, for the Forest Haven isn't already on our map. I kind of feel like that island's important enough where it should be. But apparently not, but okay. Just a wee bit north of here on Bio Biome Island, I've got s I've seen some, I've seen a merchant of incredible girth. The monster's pack on his back. Pack on his back. <laughs> what could he be doing on that lonely little island? I'll tell you, there are some strange folk in this world, Fry. That's all the info I've got to offer. That's weird that he doesn't tell you anything about um, this island. That's really weird, actually. Maybe it's just because we're done here? Like, story-wise, we're going the complete wrong way. We need to go past here. Freak a turn! That's the quickest way to turn, isn't it? Just freaking stop in your boat. Stop bending your boat. I had the updraft that goes around the island. So weird. That's the God's Island. No, we need to go this way, I guess? Is that Ice Ring Isle over? No, that's too. What's this? Uh, Private Oasis. That's not where we want to go to. It's got to be that one, right? I sure as heck hope so. Because honestly, this is getting confuzzling. Did we talk to the map fish at Windfall Island? I think we did. Yeah, we must have. So the Forsaken Fortress is the only other island. Okay, I just gotta remember that. Forsaken Fortress is the only other island that I've already been to that I <laughs> that I need to talk to the map fish. Phew. Otherwise, my charts will be forever one behind. Or they'll be forever young. I wanna be forever young. For Al I always see those like small looking tower islands. See that just to the right of my uh, my um, sail. I always see. Oh, I think that's a fair island. Actually, I might want to go there. Fishy, come here. Fishy, come home. Oh crap! Am I seriously out of bait? Starting to run. For, I know I'm not out of bait, but I'm seriously just starting to run a bit low here. No, well, six. That's not too bad, I guess. We will be kind of well. I say we will be done exploring soon, but not really. <laughs> Boy, smile, friend. Still gotta. I want to do. At least, probably go talk to all the great fairies before I start the next temple. I was initially going to do the great fairies and attack Squiddy Squids, Ice Ring Isle. That also looks like um, uh, an ear for some reason. There's amazing treasure in the freezing ring of the isle over there. But even if you wanted to get it, to get inside, you'd be frozen solid as soon as you approach the shore. But if you go four squares north and squeeze three squares north, south, west, dang it, four and three. Power to melt any ice, no matter how cold. Search for it, small fry. That's the info I got to offer. Guess what, dude? I already got it. Oops. It's interesting that maybe like after you get the avail the availability to do that mini game and arrows, it's interesting that that uh, he doesn't immediately ask if you want to do it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Yay. So yep, that is what they've been talking about. Okay, let's take a look at this island. Holy crap, this place looks cold. Hey, look, it's a yellow rupee. <laughs> you immediately freeze. That's awesome. I can definitely tell. That's that has no natural ice. It's like magic ice. Oh, if you guys gotta get a good look. 
Well, I guess you can't really get a good look at that. But, that's okay, because we are going to get a good look in a second here. Pereros. And now, we press, what, ZR, we can switch to fire and ice, which you can't really get a good look at, just because we're in the cold here. Wow, I definitely missed that. But yeah, I completely free or unfreeze the island. Yeah, five minutes to get through this place. And in typical Chris fashion, I totally want to get everything in here. Even if it's not important stuff. Because there's actually some... I think it's a treasure chart right along the ring here. Is it not? I'm pretty dang sure it is. Uh, before I forget, I want to take a look at the map here. Look at that. That totally looks like an ear, doesn't it? It looks exactly like an ear. It's weird. I don't understand why. And I've never actually even heard someone make that comparison before. But it's totally an ear. <laughs> There's the treasure chest. That's the dream I'm looking for. And I don't think I've ever run out of time doing this before. Because if you run out of time, it starts to freeze over again. And then you're screwed, dude. Uh, uh, dude, come on! Oh, thank God there's no ice temple in this game. Even though there should be. Oh, they even oh they even have a little clock you set the timer there. Was that there before? You gotta change the chart. Open the chart of the map, and then it'll light up. There's a little clock there. I've never even noticed that before. Interesting. I mean it's pretty obvious that um that's a timer. You don't need a clock there, Nintendo. But it thinks, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so we've already wasted a minute of our time. This is not looking too good for the Mr. Christophers. Alright. But at least we got all the treasures we need to progress forward. Oh, good lord. Okay, make sure you angle, angle yourself properly when you go up these ledges because you slide down for some reason. Whoa. To be fair, probably done. Should have probably fallen there. Uh, I have to collect all the things. Do I take damage in this water? I probably should, to be fair. Oh, man. Not doing so hot right now. There we go. Oh god, how would you even grab on to that? I don't know. <laughs> Did I show myself falling down? I think I must have, right? Like when you push. Ugh. Oh, I didn't fall that time. Huh. Huh. Alright, so yeah, this iceberg moves. Okay, just run. Oh, good lord. Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, this is a freaking giant dragon mouth if you couldn't already see it. I don't want to climb up here. And where do we go? Oh my good lord, there's a giant hole in here. I'm pretty sure that was just a normal small sized hole in the original game. Alright. We have more than half our time left, so that's okay. Oh good lord. I don't remember it snowing in here either. I'm going to go that way, but there's a big gust over there. A big old gust? <laughs> oh boy. Whoa, keys! Oh man, really, keys? Eh. This is the only time I'll be here, so we might as well get all the things. I want to slip. <laughs> That's so hard to ask for, Nintendo. I want to fall. Ooh, it's fairies. Well, I'm gonna pull out a bottle, but there's no point. All right, careful of the keys. Keys. I got them both. I think I've got them both. Great. Hey, look, it's a slide. I don't think there's... Oh, good lord. There's probably a way to fall off, actually. I was going to say, I don't think there's a way to fall off, but it truly is. Yeah, see, even though we, I was getting a bit skeptical there, we still had plenty of time to do this. All right, can we... Can we do this? Thank you. Ooh, there actually might be a secret in here. There is a secret in here, actually. You got the iron boots. These boots are so heavy, you can, you can hardly walk, but the wind can't blow you around when you use them. Oh, you know what? This is not, this is not the item I wanted. Oh well, I got it now. <laughs> What's up here? Can we climb up here? No, we can't. We have a little nice little edge. And yeah, it's a nice little cool dragon mouth again. That's freaking awesome, isn't it? Alright, so, so here's a gust of air there. Boy, you'll also see there's a hole in there. You might be thinking, oh, that's clearly where the air is coming from. Guess I'm just gonna ignore- <gasps> Whoa, look at how close I was there. Yeah, no, the wind gusts can't push you around. I'm not gonna let you push me around anymore. Yay. Alright, and yeah, the timer's gone now, for whatever reason. I will save you! Mo, is that you? Oh, you know what I should actually do? Let's use our grappling hook. Yeah. Oh, you dink! 
Jeez, after I got those nice fairies to help me. What are you, why are you running over here for, you dunkus? You dinkus? You know what? Aha, finally my shield can help me. I will light you on fire. Oh, that killed him. I don't remember fire and ice arrows actually being, whoa. Well, this guy looks, oh, yeah, he's black armor. Or like red armor or something. I think these guys are typically more difficult to fight against. Jeez. Well, he did the same amount of damage to me. Come on, there we go. Yeah! Grappling hook! Really? I didn't know he dodges it. Oh, it's trying to... Whoa, that's a lot of damage. Jeez, okay, I apologize. Jeez, okay, this guy's definitely harder. The other guys were not jumping out of my way before. Yeah. Oh yeah, fire and ice arrows, by the way. Can I switch? Yeah, I can. Actually, um, use magic. Oh, he's looking for a sword. Well, that was very silly. You know, wasn't it? Oh, my foot just fell asleep. Oh god. Oh god. My foot. It feels like it's wet or something. It feels like I just submerged it in water. I know that's a weird thing, but <laughs> it's. Oh good lord. Okay, that was weird. All right, we're at two hearts left. Gotta be careful. Uh, I was like, is it fairy, fairy, I need your help, fairy. <laughs> well, I do already have a fairy, so that's okay. Oh, that's cool. You see the way he put this halberd around? Oh, no. There we go. Oh, actually. Want to see something cool? Bam! Yeah, you can just completely crush them. It's awesome. I love it. Wow, I just got 25 rupees from him. Maybe more. I didn't see if I got, like, a single... I'll get a as well from that. Oh, I'll just go to the ends! Once again, should probably use that. Oops. No, I want your... Did I open it? There we go. Oh, what are you looking for, dude? Yeah! Give me your single rupee. There we go. Everything's dead. I killed them all! Killed them all! I don't know what's gonna be in here. I mean, it should be some importance, since, you know, that's pretty hidden, but it might just be a rupee. You got no rupees. One of these is worth 100 rupees. Your face is beaming. I almost said poopies, like, unsarcastically. Oh, there's another thing right here. Just a pot. I wonder how well can you guys see this. I mean, if you guys have been watching the series in full screen, then, I mean, it's probably pretty easy to see, but I kind of feel like if you're just watching this in the standard definition YouTube window, it's probably a bit difficult to see. My foot is still asleep. Can I just, I just really want to swip. Can I do, swip? <laughs> I just really want to swip, you guys. And... Oh, yeah, I guess once you beat these islands, the ground actually stays. There we go, that's what I want to do. I want to see Link's face, though. <laughs> he makes a, oh, no! Face. Which, I mean, I would, too, to be fair. Oh, uh, where's my ship at? Where's my ship at? Oh, it's on the completely other side. Are you serial? Oh, stop snowing. Oh, it starts snowing again. Oh, stop snowing again. Oh, starts snowing. <laughs> Fantastic. All right. Well, I want to get both these. Actually, I just want to get one of these items. But this is the wrong one I wanted. I wanted the one from Fire Island, apparently. Which, yeah, that makes sense. So, in the next episode, we'll go to Fire Mountain. Oh, you know what? Actually, no. We're going to go to that Fair Island over there. Yeah, we are. <laughs> You know what, should we just do that quick? Maybe we'll just do that real quick, real quick like. And we already saw in Fairy Islands. I don't think we've done any of these yet, have we? Pretty sure we have, and I'm kind of hopeful hopeful we haven't. Oh, look at those things popping up there. One of the very few yeah. times we see like three wash stars like that together. Um, I was gonna see if there's like a giant squid or something around here, but no, there, there's not. It's thunderstorming. And, oh, you know what, though? Since we'll be over here, this will be okay because there'll be fairies in here, so I'll get healed. So I don't have to worry about dying at Fire Mountain because that place, <laughs> let me tell you, is a lot more scary than Ice Ring Island. Well, not really. It just sounds scary because, I mean, let's face it, a giant snow island that's blowing ice at you is not really as scary as crazy as it sounds. Bam! Okay, I kind of think that should crush that. Um, yeah. So, burn that down. I mean, you could either burn it down or you could uh, blow it up with a bomb. Doesn't really matter. Um, I don't think there's much in there. Let's ignore those. Is there a chew here? There is a chew here. I haven't dealt with those yet. 
guess it'll be not too much longer till we can deal with those. Actually, we probably we can right now. Well, not true, actually. We need all the items in the game to be, be able to complete that. Hello! <laughs> Don't laugh at me, asshole. Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. Not gonna lie, I don't know how many hearts I'll have when I go to start these next two temples, but I don't think it's gonna be very many yet, so I'm a bit scared of that. Actually, I'm very scared of that. <laughs> you can now carry more bombs! You can now hold a maximum of 60 with you wherever you go. The fairies in this fountain show ease your weariness. When you grow fatigued from your battles, come here to be refreshed. See, the Queen of Fairies, does she control the fairies? Because that's kind of the, the thing I got. Chico from Western Fair Island, great nothing. Adventure time! Ray Child from Windfall Island. Yay! Selfie with the boat. Oh, I'm so serious right now. Alright, so that's our first bomb upgrade. I said first, so I mean, that kind of spoils up there's another one, but oops. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like. No! No, 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 no! If I leave that. Damn it! If I leave that there, will it? Uh, we have to collect it. Well, you got blue chew jelly. Keep your spoils big. Deep within blue chew chews is a gelatinous essence that's said to be a magical cure all, but unfortunately, it could be used in its current. Damn it! Ah, stupid chew! I just wanted to kill the flowers! Damn it! it sucks! Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe already. My name's Chris. The next one. We're going to... Oh, it automatically opened up my bottle for me on my gamepad. I was wondering what that noise was. I only climbed this tower only to see see you with the Lumas. Oh, Rosalina, I love you. Kind of creepy. No pinch grin. Tower of the Gods. Interesting. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, the next one, we'll go to Fire Isle. Volcano Land. Fire Mountain. We'll collect that there. You know what? The only thing... Like I said, I kind of really wanted to go to all the, get all the fairies, that are great fairies and all that. But the issue with that whole thing is I don't have all my islands down yet. And I don't know where they are. <laughs> they all like that in between episodes. Thank you guys so much for watching. Goodbye.